for you today I've just done a swap with um, my lovely friend Lisa aka Spacey's number one girl um, I've got three things in here that I bought from her because she was selling a load of her makeup off um, but the rest of it is all swap stuff um, yeah so we decided to do a swap she we both got our packages today okay, so this is my box which I'm going to open I haven't opened this at all I don't know what to expect in here um, so it's quite exciting. Oh, this is a beauty box, I think. Is this a beauty box? I don't know, I don't have them. I think this is a beauty box. This is what it looks like inside. And she's done what I did. I kind of wrapped everything up and labeled it and said what order to open it in. And she's done the same. So let's have a look. I love this paper. Oh my God. I haven't even read the letter yet, but it's pink leopard print. And it's got Barbie written on it. She oh, she knows me so well. So this is what it looks like. This is so cute. Look, it's all labelled and wrapped up. And Okay. So, let's just... All this stuff underneath. So I'm going to take all the stuff that's wrapped up out. She sent me a couple of bits that aren't wrapped. So she sent me some wipes. Three-in-one cleansing facial wipes. And these are by a company called... Osiris. Never seen these before, so I'll be interested to try these. She's also put me in um, some body lotion. This is Beautify Bathing body lotion. Looks like this. It smells like roses. So I love the scent of rose anyway, so that's good. And she sent me, what is this? A bath fizzer. Oh, it smells like sweeties. It looks like this, it's a little pink one. It's got little pieces on the top. I don't have baths very often, but I will definitely use this because I've wanted to try bath fizzers for a long, long time. So I'm going to open this one first because this has got my MAC stuff in it and I already know what this is because this is the stuff that I bought. Okay. I love the paper as well. It's so pretty. It's got little butterflies on it. So I'm going to open this one first because, like I said, I know what's in here because these are the things that I chose she's also put a sample in for me MAC Zoom Lash oh so this is mascara okay that's such a cute little thing and it's black so that's good that's what that looks like and then these are my three things I have got a knife here on hand because I had a feeling that there would be a lot of cutting and chopping involved so she sent me a big long list. I think I got first dibs of all the stuff that she was selling. And I looked through everything and there was loads of stuff that I would have had, but I'm trying to only buy stuff that I will actually use. So I just bought three things from her that I know I'm gonna use. So I bought a blush. Now this is called Warmth of Coral and it's a mineralized blush. Let me just take the bubble wrap out of it. That is really pretty. So that's what it looks like. Some of this stuff is used, but that's absolutely fine. This is what it looks like. And that's a swatch. It's a really pretty orangey coral colour. Which, oh, it smells lovely, but I really, I think that's so pretty. I've wanted to try a mineralised blush for a long, long time. So I'm really happy that I've got one of those. And then I've got two lipsticks. I got one called Freckle Tone, which is a lustre. I really like the packaging on this one because it's like glittery. Mine, my other one that I've got, my Saint Germain, is just black. This one's quite glittery. So this is um, this is freckle tone, and that's what it looks like. Now, of course, I haven't seen these colours, so I had to like Google them and kind of guess. Oh, I love the smell of Mac lipsticks. So that's the colour. It's very, very similar to the blush, which is quite nice. Very sort of neutrally. Tone. and then I got Budding Love which I think is a pink this is an amplified oh no it's not Budding Love sorry she put it in a box for me because it didn't have the box this is actually um, Chatterbox <gasps> and that's Chatterbox look at that and that's it there quite a dark one actually but I do like it so they are my three 
MAC things. Okay, so that's that. Now, all of this is, um, all the rest of this is swap stuff. So I, I don't actually know what it was. She kept texting me and she's like, do you like this? Do you like this? And I was like, I don't know. I've never tried it. So she just kept saying, I'm going to stick you some stuff in and see what you think. Oh, these wipes smell nice. I'm going to use one of these to just get the samples off my hand, but it feels really soft. And that's took that off really quickly, so that's good. So. This will look great over freckle tone. Freckle tone. That's my... Over this. Apparently, this will look great over freckle tone. have a look she does like everything that I sent her so that's good I just I'm not too sure when her video will be up <gasps> oh it's so cute it's a lip balm and it, it I wanted to try one of these but I didn't know if I'd be able to get them it's one of the love heart balms from MUA oh that smells nice as well like I said some of this is used so as you can see this has been swatched but that doesn't bother me. You can always make use out of it. So yeah, that's the swatch. And it is very similar. I'll just do another little bit of freckle tone so you can see. I don't want to use this too much. So yeah, that's freckle tone next to it. So they'll work really well together. So that was very well thought out by her. And that smells lovely. Nice big pot as well. I don't... I get annoyed by little tiny lip balms. So that's that one all new and unused this one's all new and unused hello let's see what's in this one ooh pretty stuff so let's have a look so we've got a lip liner by 17 and this is in claret or claret claret looks like this and it's like a, a ready pinky colour. And then, what's this? Hide and Chic Eye Brightening Concealer. Oh, I wanted a new concealer. This is in Light Rose. And this is also by 17. I'm going to have to open it because it's sealed. I like the packaging on this. It's quite pretty, look. One of these sorts that you then twist to get the colour, but because it's new, it may take a little while to get the colour up. Oh, here we go. Oh, that's pretty. I don't think I'll use it as a concealer, but I think I'll definitely use it as like a highlighter or something. It's just there. But that's pretty. Then I've got a Superstay colour by Maybelline. This is an 18 hour one that looks like that and this is in sparkling fuchsia so you've got one end which looks like this which is your gorgeous pink end and then this end I would assume oh this is like a balm okay so I assume I've not seen these so I would say that you put this on and then put this over it maybe if you've had one of these let me know she sent me an Avon mascara which is, um, it looks like it's a black, yes it is black. So you put this end on first and then this end. And then she sent me, oh I wanted one of these, a new brow pencil by number 7. Because obviously I'm blonde now, I need to update my eyebrow colour. Because I've been using my e.l.f. medium palette, but that's just, it's too dark now. So this is what it looks like, it's got a brush one end. And then it's got your pencil the other, and this is in blonde, so that should be ideal to lighten my brows up a little bit okay used a handful of times would look much better on you oh bless her let's see what's in this one i love doing spot videos there's so much fun and it's so exciting waiting for everything it's like, oh. it was really annoying today because she told me that it was coming today so i was like right okay i'll make sure there's somebody in and the five minutes that we were all out of the house is when the postman decided to bring it and then he was like 
I can't come and pick it up for three and a half hours. So I've just been sitting there since 11 o'clock this morning waiting to go up the sorting office and get my parcel. And it's just been like, I'm driving Mark mad. Ooh, Barry M eyeshadows. Never ever tried these. That's so pretty. It doesn't have a name. So I can't tell you the name of it. But it's got um, pink, purple, well, lilac and blue, which are really pretty. Just do a, that's the blue. So they're pretty well pigmented. So we'll try them. Oh. And then, what's this? I only used two of these, they weren't for me. Okay. She was quite cryptic about some of the stuff that she was sending me, so I was like, Ugh. Uh, these are cute and she asked me if I like makeup removal things Kleenex eye makeup removal wipes sensitive I haven't got a smell I just look like that so I'm going to keep the bubble wrap over that one to make sure that they keep the moisture in and I've got this one which hasn't got um, any sort of stick on it but it has got a really cute bow on it this feels like liquid so I'm assuming that this is going to be like a perfume or something, maybe. Oh, number seven, cleanse and care eye makeup remover. I don't have any liquid makeup removers, so this will be nice to try. Let's see if it's got any sort of a scent. No, it doesn't smell of anything. So I'll try that. What else have I got? This one hasn't got a label on it either. What's in this one? Oh, it come out. Oh, it's a gosh eyeshadow. I've not tried gosh either. I'm so behind the times when it comes to makeup because I just, I don't try things and I really should. So this is in Aqua. Looks like this. It's pretty. It's very similar to, in fact, it's almost a dupe for the Barry M. So that's cool. But it'll be nice to try it in two different um, brands to see which one I like better. This one hasn't got a label on either. Oh, this looks like a foundation, maybe. Or nail varnish. No, it's nail varnish. Oh, it's my favourite one. She sent me my Barry M nail varnish in mushroom. This is my favourite Barry M colour ever. And I've already got one, but I use it all the time. It's like my go-to colour. So now I've got a second one and it's really exciting. What else have I got? A touch of sparkle. I love all these little post-its and they're all pink as well. It's really cute. She really has put a lot of thought into this box. So it's like... Oh. Like my birthday or something or Christmas. Ooh, hello. What we got? Oh, this is Virgin V. Simply Divine Golden Lashes. Okay. Looks like that. And that's what it looks like. Now, I don't honestly think I will use this as a mascara, but what I do want to do is use it as an eyeshadow base, like a glitter base. So they always come in handy. And then she sent me this one by Benefit. Benefit. She did say I was getting a Benefit product. And this is um, a shimmer powder called Bambi. That's very pretty. I love the packaging for this as well. Let's see if we can get a sample. Like a swatch. Ooh, it's like, um, like an orangey, mustardy sort of colour. Oh, that's so pretty when you put it on. In the pot, it looks like curry powder I'm not gonna lie but when you put it on it's so pretty it's um it's got pink shimmers in it and gold and oh, that's, that's beautiful so I don't know what I'm gonna use that for but I will find a use okay some samples okay I love samples though samples are fun what we got in here she sent me a load of um, well not a load, she sent me two Avon samples that I've already got so that's quite amusing what's this? 
lash card. Oh, so that you can put it there and do your lashes or put it there. That's cool. Max Factor Ageless Elixir. New 2-in-1 foundation and serum. Oh, two of them. I love trying different foundations to see what colours I am in that. Aussie 3 Minute Miracle Colour Deep Treatment for coloured hair in need of love. Yep, yeah, that is my hair. My hair is coloured and in need of lots of love. So I'm going to try that as well. And then this is my... Oh, i got two bracelets. I love these little bracelets. Rubber bracelets. Let's put these on now. And then this is the last thing. Ordered this for you from ASOS. Hope you like it. Oh, bless her. She ordered this specially. You're so naughty, Lisa. You're not supposed to buy stuff for this. Oh, I can see pink and I can see sparkles. What is it? One size. Rhinestone gummy coil wrist. So it's a brace. Oh, this looks so pretty. Oh, look at that. And it goes all the way around. So basically, you just wrap it round your wrist and of course it's one size fits all how pretty is that oh, I love bracelets I'm really into bracelets at the moment look that's so cute I really like that well I'm really I'm so made up with everything that I've got I've got loads of stuff I mean she texts me out and she's like oh oh your box puts my box to shame but it really doesn't because there's a lot of brands in here, like you've got Gosh and Barry M and Number 7, and they're not cheap. And a lot of the stuff that I've sent her is not as high branded as what that is. But I did send her some jewellery and stuff as well. But like I said, her video will be on hopefully really, really soon. Because I really want you to all see what I got her. And I want to see what she thought of it and see her reactions and stuff. But um, I'm determined to find out what this box is. I'm assuming it's all under the addresses and stuff. I really want to know what this box is. And I know I'll get loads of people going, oh, it's this box, it's this box. I want to find out for myself. Oh, it's a carmine. There's a little part of me there really sort of thinking, please be a beauty box, but it's a carmine. But that's cool because it's a really, really nice box, really sturdy. I love the lime green inside as well, it's super pretty. So yeah, that was everything that I got in my swap box from Lisa. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you all soon.